back to another video so in today's video as you can see i'm at my mom's house um it is monday and i was kind of feeling sick earlier and i thought that i should go to my gynecologist just to check up on how i'm doing as well as hopefully find out the gender today um this week will be 18 weeks so i'm sure that we can find the gender out so um yeah i'm home alone here and I just got ready and I wanted to take you guys along obviously on my journey on finding out the gender and all of those things so I'm so excited and I'm just so I'm nervous as well like and I don't know how I'm gonna record it in the actual um, doctor's rooms but if I cannot um, put my tripod anywhere then I'm going to do a reaction video of my reacting to the gender um, I'm basically going to ask them to write it down for me and then I'm going to open it in the car. I did not tell anyone that I'm going today to the doctor, um, to the gynae to even check the gender or anything. So um, it's just going to be a surprise because my initial date was the... My hands are so sore. My initial date, that's better. My initial date was the 18th of November, which is on Friday. However, I could not wait because i feel like it's just like an instinct thing where you feel like you need to go you know early so it's just a few more days earlier and um they're charging me because i'm paying cash they're charging me extra because it's like an emergency or because it's like making a booking on the day for the day kind of thing so that's completely fine and i understood so i got dressed up a bit and did some simple makeup and i'm going to show you guys my outfit just now so I'm going to go and get some food before I leave and maybe like a hazelnut iced coffee or something just to wake baby up before I go there. So hopefully he or she is moving and um, yeah, I've planned a little special surprise gender reveal thing for my loved ones. So I'm going to know the gender today and I'm going to be quiet because no one even knows I'm going to the doctor. And Sorry, I just had to take a call. Um, but like I said, yeah, I'm planning like a little gender reveal thing for my loved ones. Um, on Friday, I'm having like a birthday dinner thing, so I'm just gonna get either pink or blue like certain stuff and make like little hampers for them and let them open it at the restaurant that we're going to. But I'll know, so I just want to get like their reaction, but you'll get my reaction today. Um, but I don't think I'm gonna tell you what it is, but you'll just see the way I react when I open the envelope. Just so I capture that moment and one day, baby, you're gonna be watching this. Mommy loves you with all my heart. And um, yeah, I'm very, very excited for this day. So 14 November today, so excited. And just, I just can't wait. So yeah, let me show you my outfit and let me get this baby some food and then we're gonna go. Um, my appointment is at half past one. So now it's about quarter to one. So I'm definitely gonna make it on time today. Let's show you the look. All right, just excuse those boxes there. My mom is currently moving as well. Um, but this is the outfit for the day. I'm just wearing these sandals, which I think are so cute. And you know what? I got them from Checkers, actually. And they were like 99 Rand. I'm sure they were like 99 Rand. But I think they're so cute and they're just so comfortable. So I want to get white as well. So I've got the black one with the little gold thing. Um, yeah, from Checkers, I think... I think it was 99 rand so yeah about 100 rand and i'm just wearing a black little jigging if you look at me like this i did not look pregnant at all but if i turn to the side you can see the little bumpy there <laughs> um but yeah from the side you cannot see anything but yeah i'm wearing the black like a jigging with this black vest from cotton on it is like a ribbed vest from cotton on and then this coat is from mr price and the sleeves are like this it's like already folded and like stitched together so really love this just with some gold jewelry love this look so much i think it's really cute and yeah um let's get going also, if you've watched my pregnancy video by now, I just want to say thank you for all your love and support because I know there's going to be so much of amazing comments and just so much that's going to make me feel so happy. Um, and even like with Instagram, when I posted like, thank you all for like all your sweet comments and shares and it was just so overwhelming and there was like so many comments, like over a hundred that I, I could not reply to everyone, but I just liked it. I double tapped on it and just know that it means the world to me. 
and your love and support means absolutely everything to my baby and I. So thank you for that. Um, yeah, let me get going and stop talking so much because I don't want to be late. I got my food. Um, I got like spicy nuggets and chips and an iced coffee. Hopefully the baby wakes up now. And um, I put like a little story on my Instagram. Is it a girl? Or is it a boy? What do you think? So like comment down below. Pause this video, comment down below and let me know. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I, I know what I feel it is. I know what I feel it is. But we only can get confirmation from a professional. So um, yeah, I'm so excited. Let me continue eating my nuggets. And, um, yeah, this is just also surreal. And, oh, I'm so excited. I cannot wait to go. Like, I'm so excited. Oh, oh my gosh, okay, I'm here. I feel so nervous. Um, this car park doesn't really have the best lighting, to be honest. So, I don't know if I want to open the envelope here when I get out. Oh, my gosh, I feel nervous. Um, I'm 15 minutes early, so I'm just going to wait here. And I'll go in like maybe in about five minutes. I just need to get myself together. Just want to pray and um Oh yeah. I'm gosh, I don't know how to explain this guys. If you have if you've been pregnant and you knew it's your day to find out the gender, tell me how you felt. Cause I just feel like so excited. Like I just wanna as soon as I walk in they must say girl or boy. Like that's it. But yeah, um I don't know. <sighs> Hi guys, so it is actually December and I know this is a very weird sort of angle um, but anyway, this is my phone and I'm trying to record this. I was trying to export this file but it was not working and this vlog needs to be up because many people follow me on Instagram and know the gender and then many people who just follow me on YouTube don't know the gender. So it's currently load shedding so I'm just trying to edit this video while I have some time but this is how I found out and um, I couldn't wait I couldn't do the letter thing so that's why I just thought I'd insert this clip now so I'm sorry for the bad videoing but this is how I found out and I hope you can catch a glimpse of my reaction or just hear the sound of my voice I just got back and these are the scans of the baby look at how big the baby is um i need to actually get this like i need to get an album and just make sure that i save everything i just got to the mall now um because i don't know if i should let my family wait for friday because i cannot wait to tell them and i don't know if i can keep a secret for long because my mom is going to like push me to tell her so, um, I literally just only called the dad now and told him the gender and I'm going to, uh, I just, I don't know what I should do. So I'm here at the mall. I want to do the balloon thingy, but also it's just also so cliche. Um, but I think I should get like my family little gifts. And you know what, Lund, you get like pink chocolates and you get blue, those chocolates. So I think I want to buy that. And since I'm not having a gender reveal or anything like that, I'm going to do little gift bags for like family members. And um, go and drop it off today. Everyone lives in the area. So I think I'm going to go and drop it off at their house and just let them open it and see their reaction. I'm so happy. Um, I'm going to insert the clip 
off the skin like towards the end um but yeah i'm so excited i'm so excited um i cannot believe i can't believe it like i can't believe it um ah yeah i'm just in shock still and so happy and it's what i prayed for and it's what i wanted and they said that the baby's healthy everything is good with baby so yeah um i was so shocked when i was looking at the scan and like i heard the heartbeat for the very first time and it was just so amazing it's just an it's just a feeling that i can't even describe how it felt to listen to the heartbeat for the first time and when the gynecologist told me the agenda i started crying and i was like screaming but i was also crying i was like ah! and then like tears came out and he just got a shock and he looked at me and i'm like i'm sorry but it's what i wanted so i'm so sorry um yeah so they said everything is good i just need to go and do some bloods now before 20 weeks because now it's about um 17 and a half weeks 17 weeks and four days or something so yeah very much excited so so excited and so blessed actually that like what i prayed for actually happened so i'm gonna go and get the stuff maybe i should tell you i'm having a baby boy <laughs> um because you're gonna see me getting i want to get like lint chocolates and stuff so i want you to see um basically the the whole thing of what i'm gonna do for my family and it's just so exciting it is so exciting and i'm so happy and so blessed and this is my first well my grandparents first great grandson uh the rest of my cousins all have girls and i'm the only one now that's having a boy so very very happy about that it's the first little boy in our family after a very long time so so happy that it's a boy and yeah just very very grateful for um a healthy baby and a happy baby like he was moving and stuff inside and it was so weird to see like he was just like moving and turning and like thank goodness his legs were open so that they could see uh the gender and before the doctor could even tell me the gender i already saw it there already we, we just he was moving it there and he put it there and he said it looks like it's a boy and i already saw the little thingy there so oh i'm so happy i'm really really happy um yeah i'm gonna call my dad and tell him and then my mom and brother i'll probably get them like a balloon or something and like let them pop it later or get them little gift bags to show them uh if it's pink or blue later on I'm fine. The car guy's asking me if I'm okay. Let me go into the shop before I melt in here. Yo yeah, guys, I'm honestly dying in this heat. Can you see me? Um, it is so hot and I cannot wait to go home and just take this out. Anyway, and this is what I've got. Blue lint chocolates. So I bought a few boxes. Um, I'm gonna do a little... Um, Thing for like my family they all live like in the area since I'm not having a gender reveal like I said I bought these like silver party box thingies they didn't have white I wanted white and then I've got like silver tissue paper which is like 12 rand I got this I got all of these stuff from the China mall and then I got pink and blue ribbon I didn't buy a lot this is actually like three rand each so I got pink and blue ribbon, so I wanna, you have to make up the box and I'm gonna put the tissue paper in it and fill it up with all the lint and then tie it up with the pink and bo uh, blue ribbons. They didn't have bows, I wish they had bows so I could just stick it on top because I don't like tying things and like then you must do the curly thing with the scissor and whatever, it's just so intense. My mom is bothering me, she's constantly asking me because I did end up telling them, hey I know the gender and I'm gonna tell you guys today. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go now and do that and then I'll show you guys how it looks at the end. And then that is it for this video. Um, whew, yeah, it has been one hectic, hectic day, but I'm very excited. So let's go and make these party, party packs, party boxes. Done. In here is like, I got one box of chocolates. Um, the lint, I'm going to do four. 
So I've got the lint chocolate and then I've got all of the, I put like a tissue paper and then chocolates on top. And then I'm just going to close it and then it looks something like that and then tie the pink and blue ribbons on top of it. So it looks quite cute. 